climate change kill the megalodon? Or was it Jason Statham? It ruled the ocean for 21 million years and then, yeah, it just kind of disappeared. Uh, with many people thinking to this day it's still in our waters. But what in fact killed off the Meg? Well, new research maybe has the answer, finally. A new study claims that the shark itself could be to blame for its own death. But why? Well, because the Meg was pretty crap at regulating its body temperature and couldn't deal with cooling oceans. <laughs> yeah, so that's right, climate change killed the Meg. Tess found out that when compared to modern day sharks, Megs maintained a higher body temperature. In fact, the body temperature of the Meg was around the same temperature of whales uh, and was unable to adapt to the environment around them. And yes, when the ocean started to cool during the Pliocene, the Meg just couldn't adapt and it went extinct. Or did it? Yeah, it, it definitely did. No, it's uh, fake news. It is. They're really gone. Uh, and because the Meg has such a high body temperature, it had a rather high metabolism, which meant that it needed to eat frequently. So when the waters cooled, the Meg's prey adapted, and in a nutshell, they just swam away to another warmer part of the ocean, leaving the big Meg behind. Um, you kind of feel sorry for it now. It's, it, it died cold and alone. So yeah, it couldn't adapt to the climate change, and all of its food left the area, the Meg really didn't have a chance. So this new study will hopefully start shining a light on what really happened to the Meg and maybe might spark even more research into the extinct Megalodon. So do you believe that it was climate change that killed off the Meg? Or like Sean, do you still believe that they're haunting a small corner out in the ocean somewhere? Yeah, I say- a small corner, it's massive. It's a massive corner. It's definitely not at the bottom of the ocean where it's really cold. They're wearing jumpers. Ooh. They've got little jumpers on. <laughs> uh, let's have a chat about it in the comments. If you're watching this on Twitter, then why not give us a like and a retweet at our awesome YouTube family. You guys know what to do. Thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.